Hello friends, welcome back to another video and today we are going to know about the history and progress of economic transactions. In the ancient societies, when people had to trade, they used to give items in exchange for other items. This was called the barter system. During those times, goods served the purpose of money. With the development of trade, barter system could not meet the growing demands of a convenient exchange system. Therefore, people started using a token or symbolic goods in exchange all over the world. For example, American Indians used beads of shells, Fijians used whale's teeth, and North Americans used tobacco as their currency. The precise origin of money in the form of coins is not clearly known. As for the available sources, the earliest coins date back to about 700 BC when stamped pieces of metal were used as a medium of exchange by Lydians who lived in Asia. Some people also believe that coins were used by the Chinese even earlier than that. Coins were preferred because they were durable and easy to carry. Coins of those times were irregular in their shape and were stamped with rough designs. The money value of a coin depended on the metal from which it was made. Coins were mostly made of gold, copper and silver because they were precious and durable. In the 9th century, the use of paper money started in China, but it did not develop in Europe until the 17th century. The government of different countries favored the use of paper currencies and coins to simplify the monetary dealings as what mattered was the money value printed or stamped on them and not their real values. This is because the printed value on currencies denotes their purchasing power as assured by the government. Larger payments were generally made using paper money as the coins were heavy and bulky. Nowadays, the mode payment is being transformed from cash or quest to electronic transactions, from one account to another. This form of electronic payment is referred to as electronic money. So guys, that's it for today and I'll see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye.